Okay. Here we have 2.1, finding x and y intercepts, given the graph of a line on a grid, find the y-intercept and the x-intercept of the line below. Click none if applicable. So here they're wanting the y-intercept. That would be where the graph crosses the y-axis, and that happens here. And what value is that? If this is 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, each of these markings is one unit, so then I would count 1, 2, 3. So my y-intercept is 3. Same thing here, my units go to 5, so 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, that means each unit is 1, and that's my x-intercept since it's where it crosses the x-axis, um, and so then that would be positive 2. If we move on to the next problem, it doesn't ever cross the y-axis. So here is where you would select none. It does, however, cross the x-axis right here. Right, That's the x-intercept. And what value is that? If this is 5, then that makes 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. So this would be 2. That x-intercept would be a positive 2. And then the last example is this here. So notice that they switched. Be careful, make sure you're paying attention to which one they're asking you for. So for the x-intercept, it does not ever uh, intersect my x-axis. So for x-intercept, I would be selecting none. However, for the y-intercept, it does intersect the um, graph here in the y-axis. What is that value? If this is negative, then this is 1, 2, negative 2. So the y-intercept would be negative 2.